Okay, beautiful. I thought I see something nice. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh, that scared me. Oh. Whoa. Well done. What was that? Well, welcome back, you guys. I kind of feel like I haven't played Fallout 4 in a little bit. I'm not going to lie, you know. But here we are. As I can see where we last left off, bro, I think we got to go and I got to find a railroad. I basically the Freedom Trail, y'all. Hmm. And I do have some DLC missions here that we're going to ignore for now. You know, this game is pretty vast. But I wanted to say, just I'm just going to record this episode today. I don't want to get into New Vegas yet. But would you guys like to see me play or try New Vegas after this video drops? Because I'm not really sure when this video is going to drop yet. But let me know down in the comment section if y'all would like to see me play New Vegas for y'all and try it out. Because Fallout is a pretty big game. And I'm not sure when I'm going to finish this game yet. But I would definitely like to try New Vegas, especially while the hype is still, you know, going around, going crazy. So let me know what you guys think, man. I do appreciate you guys for tuning in, man. And we're just going to do what we got to do. You know, we're just going to do what we got to do. And yeah, bro, let's get this episode started, y'all. Yeah? I'm excited. I'm excited. There's a lot of games I want to bring to this channel for y'all. And I'm really just be trying to make time for everything. But, you know. One one step at a time, y'all. One step at a time. There's hella side quests that I've been ignoring because I can't really go around doing side quests when I'm trying to record for y'all for real, you know. But I do hope y'all understand. You know, there's some side quests I do, but others, I just can't really invest as much time, you know. Yeah. If you guys see what I'm trying to say. But yeah, bro, let's do this, dog. But real quick, let me see if I can open my personal storage container. Real quick. Because if, if I could, and if I could somehow send stuff to the storage, that will make my life way easier. So it's on top. Nice. Okay. Dope. I was definitely running out of space, bro. I need to drop something. I think we'll just... We'll start a machete. I really don't use a machete for real. We'll start that sniper as well. I prefer the powerful switchblade. Yeah, you're out of there. All right, y'all, did some research and um, following this trail. I tried following it before. I had gave up. It seemed like I was going around in circles. But now here we are at this church, and let's see if we're in the correct place. Okay. Com okay, yeah, we definitely are then. Now you pay for it. Hold on, Piper, calm down. I don't really got much help for ammo. That's the thing. But, uh... It's fine. We'll always find things as we venture forth. We know how this goes. Piper, do something, please. Mm, Piper's gonna be wrecked. Let me, let me use my melee. I don't have much ammo at all, y'all. Seems like it's just cool, so I'm gonna just use my melee for now. Well, it seems like this is definitely the right way to go. Before we venture forth, let's see what lies over here. Nice. Definitely need all that. I need all lens, all the ammo, everything. What's in here? A psycho. Okay, silver spoon. And this building seems very interesting. What are you guys hiding? I seen where to go already. I just want to see if there's anything out of use over here. Piper, you look, he scared me. I thought he was an enemy. I was getting ready to, to wreck something, boy. Like, for real. Okay, I mean, well, we see where to go. Let's get going. This is where I came from. Hmm, dope. I made space, so I do have some weight that I can I, I can basically basically carry more stuff now. 
Just in case, let me heal and just use a stem pack. Mm, Piper, take care of that for me, please. Mm, what happened to him? He disappeared or? Wow. Just come running. No mine at all. So the ghouls in this game, they're basically people like is the radiation that made them turn into ghouls? I think that's what it was. Or I think that's what it is. Ah Oh, that did damage. Like that? Hold on. That's dope. Oh, look at the blood of my weapon. Hold on, let me see what this weapon says. I want to see there's something special about it. Okay, nothing special for her. I did level up, right. Okay. Hmm, so what do I got to look for some type of code or something, bro? Okay. Nothing. There's definitely like some type of hint that I'm ignoring. There's definitely a big hint that I'm ignoring. Seems like I'm close. So much starts with R. Okay. Okay, so it starts with R. This is interesting. Oh my gosh, I folded. Let me try spinning it to A. Okay, so I think that's good. I think I just gotta spell it out. Let me try doing I now. Okay, seems like we're onto something here, y'all. So you're doing the. What you wanna do is to spell out the word railroad, and that is pretty much it. Let me look at the quest real quick. See what it says. All right. So, R works again. Okay. So, yeah, I could I could definitely act like some type of genius I found this out, y'all. But, I definitely had to do some research. I was not going to be able to find it solo. <laughs> I'm sorry. You feel me? I'm an honest guy. I definitely had to do some research. And, all we got to do is spell out railroad. <laughs> I, I would have been on this forever. Ah. Nice. Oh, Piper, we found the Freedom Trail. Okay, beautiful. I thought I see something nice. Oh my gosh. Right there. Oh. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting, but before we go any further, oh, that scared me. My questions. Who the hell are you? Them boys got power. I followed the Freedom Trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? I had to make something up. I don't want to get anyone into trouble. We'll find out, one way or another. Last question. Why are you here? Nah, I might as well come as a full story, right? I tracked down and killed a courser at Green Tech Genetics. Now I need help breaking the code on his courser chip. You have what? This is not a joking matter. I didn't know we were having a party. What gives with my invitation? Oh, I see you invited the courser killer. Nice. Deacon, you're late. You're saying this intruder actually killed a courser? Single handedly? <laughs> oh. That would give even Gloria a run for her money. Newsflash, boss. This guy is kind of a big deal. If you're done interrogating him, you might want to show this coarser murdering machine a little courtesy. <laughs> Just a thought. I owe you an apology. Anyone who kills a coarser is good in my book. I'm Desdemona, and I'm the leader of the railroad. 
Who are you people exactly? In a world full of suspicion, treachery, and hunters, we're the synth's only friend. Des, we need to let him in. He's got an intact courser chip, for God's sake. That violates our security protocols. To hell with that. He killed a courser. There's no way he's working for the Institute. We're letting you into our headquarters. You're the first outsider ever to be given this privilege. Oh, this is Trust getting crazy. Your chip inside. This is getting crazy. Okay. Don't try anything, stranger. I don't want no smoke, we buddy. Don't worry. Yet. Talk to the boss. Okay, let's get going. Des the Mona. I definitely pronounce that terribly. Des the Mona. I don't even know. Des the Mona. I don't know how to pronounce it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I heard her say the name. Like I'm tripping. Or I heard the guy say the name. I don't even know. Bro, I know I just opened this door. Come on. Yeah, this is getting pretty intriguing, bro. I'm not gonna hold ya. Fortunately, we have the right man for the job. Wow. Don't try anything, stranger. Bro, eat your ramen in peace. Whoa! For real? Oh man, it's been ages! Right, some ground rules. Tom can get you the code, but once he's done, we get the courser chip. Do I need a chip for anything? Do I need that's what I'm trying to see if I need a chip for anything. Don't the girl need a chip? Fine. It's yours. Alright. Tom, make it happen. Alright, little course of chip. Let's have the circuit analyzer take a crack at you. Mm, so I just wait in peace, wait in silence We're and awkwardness. In. Chip access. Just poke the analog connectors a little. What? Oh man, don't, don't don't crash. Hold it together. Memory hiccup. Here it comes. Encryption algorithms. All right. All right, we're still running. Nice. Tom is lit. Oh man, they've added more decimals to the last cipher. This is gonna be. Come on, baby, show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. <laughs> Lucky. I got you, you institute bastard. I got you. Soft way in. Come on. Show me that sweet bass note. Come on. Then we got it. We got the code. <laughs> Let me load that onto the hollow tape for ya. Good work, Tom. Yeah, but I'm not sure our luck will hold up next time, Des. Start working on the rest of the chip. And you. I'd love to work with you more. Let me know if you're interested. But to be crystal clear, if you use that data and discover anything involving the Institute, you share it with us first. Otherwise, our relationship will be in jeopardy. Right. More going on than you know. Trust me. Huh. I know. Fallout got some allure. Well, yeah, um, it definitely seems like we're returning to... Wow, do you guys have dead bodies and stuff in their place? This is fascinating. Damn, I can't borrow these yet? <laughs> okay, not yet. I guess we'll wait. We finally found this freedom trail. That is amazing. Let's definitely get out of here. I doubt I'll be able to fast travel. If we're going to be dealing more with each other, I need to make sure that we're on the same page. Don't try anything, You know stranger. what sin looks right? Yeah, I know all about them. Good. The Institute treats synths as property, as tools. Go on. 
So we seek to free the synths from their bondage. Give them a chance at a real life. I have a question. The only question that matters. Would you risk your life for your fellow man? Even if that man is a synth? It depends, bruh. It depends on the circumstances. There's no middle ground with this. Would you risk death to save a synth or not? Mm -hmm. I think I just gotta say I'll do it just so I could, just, just so they could be more my side or something. Once I pledged my life to protect my countrymen. I don't see this as any different. Well said. Someone with your skills, your beliefs. Normally, we'd try and recruit you. But right now, we don't have the time to train up a new agent. There are, however, other valuable ways you can contribute. And in turn, we can help you. See Deacon for details. You're free to go. Hmm. You didn't see anything suspicious coming in, right? After you leave, I get to do a full security suit before you can get out of here, too. Sure, man. All right, let me talk to Deacon. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. Your leader was just being cautious. I'll take hurt feelings over becoming the Institute's plaything any day. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Come on, what I look like a rat? Don't worry, I'll keep your secret. That's what I want to hear. So Des wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone who helps out with the odd job here and there. What a waste. I'm just going to come out and say this. The railroad needs you. I'm not sure. I'll tell you the game plan. Then you decide. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Dez invites you into the fold. Then, okay. if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. Okay. Uh, Sign me up then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. Okay, dope. Well, I'll meet up with Deacon at the freeway. Um, let me return to Virgil real quick. Let me return to Virgil. Can I fast travel from here? Of course I can't. All right, amazing. I'm happy that we found a freedom trail, though. Well, I needed help finding it, but you know, we found it, y'all. Yeah? And now we're just continuing on with the missions, you feel me? I would have never thought I would have kept playing this game until now, to be completely real with y'all. Okay, Virgil. Let's go ahead and talk to him and see what's up. Yeah, Death Claw. I don't want no smoke. We learn our lesson from past experiences. Wasn't sure I'd see you again. You managed to get what you need. I have the code. Suppose I shouldn't be surprised. You did get rid of Kellogg after all. Not too much of a leap to take down a courser. How'd you manage to get it decoded? The railroad helped me. Oh god, those kooks. I would have expected they'd be too busy trying to liberate vending machines or setting computer terminals free or... <laughs> Sorry. They just have something of a reputation. You're not the only one who's been busy. I did the best I could from memory and things I've overheard through the years. Came up with some schematics for you. Wasn't easy. These hands are ridiculous. Fine motor skills have gone to shit. 
Here's the symbol explanation. You need to build a device that will hijack the signal the Institute uses to teleport coursers and send you instead. You know the craziest part of the design? That classical music station. That's the carrier signal for the relay. All the data's on harmonic frequencies. Wow. You've been hearing it all along. I want to be clear that this isn't my area of expertise. I was bioscience, not engineering or advanced systems or anything. I'm sure it'll work. For the record, I haven't made any promises. But if you can build this device and make use of that code, you should be able to override the signal from the Institute's relay. Can you? I mean, can you build it? You have people that can help. This is a lot for one person, even you. I got it covered. Good, good. Because you've got to make it in there. For both our sakes. And don't you forget our agreement. I've helped you as best I can. If you make it in there, you find that serum. It's my only hope for ever being normal. So you find it. Now go on. Take these and get to work. You do whatever it takes. Call on whoever you know to help you. Hmm. Well, definitely I'm gonna uh, go to the minute, man. But the Brotherhood seemed like they got this, the technology for it. I gotta meet Deacon over here as well. We'll talk to, oh my gosh, of course I can't fast travel. I gotta go outside. I don't like how we can't fast travel. Like, I get if you're on enemies, bro, but if you're in friendly area, dog, it shouldn't be that way. I was actually crazy, bro. I came to the glowing sea without armor. You know, the Minuteman was the first people that I, you feel me? So let's see what they say. That was the first people I teamed up with. I have not seen Cobworth in a minute, y'all, bro. That thing always seemed to just surprise me. <laughs> it's like it just says hello every time. Hey. What do you need, General? I have plans here to build a signal interceptor that can get me inside the Institute. The Institute? Why in the world would you want to mess around with them? They kidnapped my son. Damn. That's some bad business. Even for them. We'll give you whatever help we can. Don't worry about that. Now, assuming you could build this thing, what exactly does it do? The Institute uses teleportation to get in and out. This machine can hijack their signal and send me instead. Teleportation? For real? Wow. That would explain a lot about how the Institute manages to operate. If anyone can make heads or tails of those plans, it'd be Sturgis. I haven't found anything yet that he couldn't build or fix. I'll let you know if I hear of any settlements that need our help. In the meantime, make sure to offer help to anyone that needs it. That can only help our cause. <laughs> That's funny, bro. Seems to be growing well. You want my two caps? We should keep moving. I'm, I'm not trying to talk to you. I don't really care. Now, the trick with water pumps is to find a good spot for them. Some place you can dig down the groundwater. Preston thought you might be able to figure out these plans for me. Sure thing. Let's see what you've got. Here you go. Wow, what a mess. Hmm. Looks like uh, encrypted RF transmissions. Okay, so that gets routed through. What the hell? Mm -hmm. Teleportation. This is some pretty crazy shit. You sure it's for real? Oh, it's for real. It's real. I got it from an ex Institute scientist. Seriously? I didn't know you could be an ex-institute anything and still be breathing. Anyway, the eggheads never think about the nuts and bolts of actually making something work. But, uh, looks like it's all here. Yeah, I'm gonna need some time to study this thing. The handwriting's pretty hard to make out. But, uh, you can get started on what he calls a stabilized reflector platform. Uh, it'll need some pretty high-grade metals. 
but it's basically not that different than the lining of a jet engine or something like that. Can you give me a list of what I'll need to build this platform? Yeah, sure. Here's a list of what you'll need for the first piece. I'm pretty sure we've got all that at Sanctuary, if you want to build it there. While you're working on that, I'll get busy figuring out how to actually build the rest of this thing. Keep in mind, I can already see this is going to take a crazy amount of juice. Like if you had a spare nuclear reactor handy, I probably, probably do. Use it. <laughs> and it's going to be big. So find a nice open building site with lots of power available. This better be dope. Dang, I completely forgot what I'm trying to build, bro. The reflector platform. Okay, dope. Nice. Make myself useful. <laughs> no one wants to see a grown man feeling sorry for himself. Huh. Oh, but Let's no. trade some things. I know I'm keep that. person here who's lost the point. How's it going? Did you find a good spot to build your signal interceptor? Yeah. Ready to build the rest of it. Good. I think I got a handle on this crazy contraption. At least as much as I can tell. Well, until we actually try to build it, here's a list of three things that may be harder to find. I think I'll be able to pull together everything else we're going to need. I'll meet you over at the building site and see if we can actually make this thing work. Thanks, Sturgis. I'll get right on this. Good deal. One thing to keep in mind while you're building this, it all needs to be wired together so all the pieces can talk to each other. I'll see you over at the building site. Good luck. Interesting. I'm trying to make it look cool. This is pretty crazy. This is pretty crazy, y'all. Okay, let me see. It says it all needs to be wired together. I hope I'm doing it right. It says, hold on. Wire this into the same power grid as a beam emitter. Oh, this thing requires 20. Well, y'all, I just got done building these generators. It says it requires 25, 10, 15, right? Mm, am I doing something wrong? I think I am. Oh, I forgot to attach it over here. Is it good now? No? I feel like I messed up with all these wires that I did, y'all. This looks ridiculous. I got a wire into the same power grid as a beam emitter. Ah, okay. And is this a beam emitter? Be real, y'all. I don't know what I'm doing. Well, y'all, after countless tries, I finally did it, bro. Just gotta make sure we've got enough power. Hey, Sturgis. Everything looks good on my end. You ready to see if this thing actually works? Oh, man. We did it, y'all, but we're gonna check that out later, to be honest. I have some things to do first. We're yeah, gonna check cool. it out later. I'll keep tuning this baby. Although we won't know if it's going to work until we actually try it. Right, for a fact. Yeah, because I don't want to do anything crazy yet. And then, then, you feel me? I want to take care of this other mission first. I want to meet up with um, meet up with Deacon at the old highway. So we're just going to go ahead and do that. We're just going to go ahead and do that, y'all. And see where that leads us before we get going with this mission right here. But things are getting really crazy, bro. Things are getting really crazy. Oh. Whoa. Hold on. Yeah. We definitely do. What was that? I think that's where Deacon is. That's perfect. That makes complete sense. Of course something like this is going to happen. What's going on here, Fallout? I'm trying to see. Is that is that the exact... Deacon is over here. But where did this thing land? I'm not even sure. Is there aliens in this game? 
Hold on, is that it? Hold on, this is real fascinating, y'all. What, what, what is this? Oh, nice, a giant roach. Yeah, let's go ahead and kill that. I'm mean, thinking that was it, bro. Yeah, I mean, nuclear material. That's a glowing roach, it's pretty creepy. Okay, I have no idea where that thing landed, y'all. It'd be dope if I could find it. Somewhere in the map, maybe? Hmm, okay. I mean, let's just go talk to Deacon first. We'll worry about that later. Because I don't know where that landed. But that's pretty cool, y'all. That might be a DLC mission, if anything. Right? Oh, wow, look what I just found. Hold on. It's always something, y'all, distracting us from the main missions, bro. Wow. Hacking this is beyond oh, me. Ah, man. Security's too good. Dang, this looks like it's interesting. Y'all wonder what's over here. Okay, we'll come back for this. We'll definitely come back for this when I level up and could hack master terminals. Right now, I think I can only hack like advanced ones. Or, nah, I think I'm tripping. I don't think I could hack. I think I, I can only do the novice, <laughs> to be real with y'all. Okay, Deacon, whatever this happened, I hope it has something to do with you, buddy. Okay, we're here shooting. Is that you, Deacon? Deacon? Is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander Camo. Wow. This is my pile. Get on with it already. I almost didn't wreck it. That's the point. So, about the job. The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. Your base was under a donut shop? It's a lot better than it sounds. Well, it was, until it was blown to hell. That sounds really, really bad. It was a disaster with a capital D. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. Let's find it then. We gotta do one thing first. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump him for information before we dive in. For now, I'll take point. So I'm looking for rail signs. Symbols we use to send messages to each other. If you like that, we got signs and counter signs, dead drops, even a secret handshake. All right, hmm. the handshake never got on. Anyway, the tourist should have a trail left for us. Okay. Here we go. Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. So our tourist is up ahead. Let's keep going. Nice. Up ahead. Hmm. Seems like you guys kind of had a hard time, man. I was honestly trying to save my ammo, but these guys are pretty weak, so I'm not too worried. But I'm definitely not trying to waste my ammo on these guys, though. Hmm, is there anything out of use over here? Nice. Night vision sniper rifle. That, ah, uh, I might have to pick it up. I might, I, I had to pick it up, y'all. Yeah. I want to try that out. I actually want to try that out. Ah, that's pretty cool. Oh, shoot, there's a guy. Hi. Once your friend gets here. How about we have a chat? So where is Deacon? Where does man Deacon went? Are you kidding me? Did it, did he fall down, bro? Bro, did this man Deacon stop moving because I went ahead? Wow. Okay. See the plus in the center? That means there's an ally nearby. Our tourist. You take point on the conversation. Look, no matter what he says, you just say mine is in the shop. Trust me. Okay, mine is in the shop. So these buses take terminals. Oh, that's a nuclear Coca Cola. Let's go. All right. Take your sweet time. <laughs> like we don't got things to do. Hi. Oh, thank God. You have a Geiger counter? You have a goddamn Geiger counter? Mine is in the shop. Who the hell is he? HQ said <laughs> they were sending one agent, not two. Sorry, I'm new. He's just showing me the ropes. All right. The wall is my witness. I thought I was dead. It's about goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here. 
Tell me what's going on. I signed on for some light recon. But that little slocum's Joe of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dome synth sons of bitches. The front's fortified to hell and back. They place mines all over the goddamn place. I appreciate all you've done. I hope it helps. I really do. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, better ask soon. Hey, Ricky. You need something else? Sniper fire will be dope. Base. Once we strike, use your rifle to pick off anyone you can see. A lot of lives are depending on us. You silver tongue son of a bitch. <laughs> Let's go. Right, I'll take a couple shots. If I see any of them coming for me, I'm running for the hills. We're done. Let's go add a add a sauce up a little bit. You get the hell out of here. And don't look back. Hey, Ricky. You should get the hell out of here and don't look back. <clears throat> well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? You think he's telling the truth? Speaking of truth, why did you lie to Ricky? My job in the railroad is intel. That job's easier if no one knows who I am. So... I lied. I do that. So you handled the talky talk, and I got to watch from the sidelines. Go team up. This man Deacon's hilarious, yeah. He's probably telling the truth, but you never can tell. I agree. Odds are good we can take him at face value. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So, we're going in through the escape tunnel. Oh. The tunnel has got to be easier than a frontal assault. Easier, but no cakewalk. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. Okay. Well, I guess it's time to get going now, y'all. It seems like it's about to be epic. I might, depending on how long this takes, I might just save the little transportation, teleportation thingy for the next episode. But let's see right now. Let's make our way down and yeah. Oh, I'm hearing gunfire. Is, is that you, Piper, being dumb? Of course. Uh, well, she's protecting herself. As long as you don't get us caught, dog. Wow, that's funny. I literally just found this tunnel. And now, <laughs> we're back over here. I thought I was going to come back on my own time. This is dope. Let's do this. I hope it lets me in now since I don't have the code. So it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Carrington. Okay. Yeah, things are getting real interesting. Let's do this. All right, y'all. So the back entrance is safer, but be ready for Gen ones and twos. So it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a Picked prototype developed by today. our good Dr. Carrington. Let's see. Am I gonna be able to unlock this now? Can't break the code. So how we're supposed to do this, buddy? The back entrance is safer, but be ready for Gen ones and twos. So okay. it's time you learn why we're here. We're retrieving a prototype developed by our good Dr. Garrett. What can you tell me about the Gen ones and twos? The synths didn't start off as nigh perfect copies of human beings. The institute had to work up to that level of hubris. Gen 1s and 2s were stepping stones along the way. The railroad's not fully united on how we feel about them. Let's find a prototype then. Together with you? I like our odds. First step is to override the security lockdown. I mean, I guess you're going to do that, right? Because I'm not no master at this thing right here. Well, the terminal's on at least. I'm going to feed it some passwords. No. 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 Hmm. Bastards. The prototype's deeper inside. 
Oh, let's get going. Someone left a rail side here. Uh, this one is danger. You know, go ahead, bastard. Yeah. Okay. I just seen somebody moving. Ah, oh, it's a scent. Definitely not gonna hit that shot. I mean, we're pretty much detected, I believe. Hello. Oh, I thought I killed him. Okay. There's something in the water. Giant roach, nice. Blue, we're not alone. Bro, come on, leave me alone, dog. Bro, am I not hitting any shot? Oh, it's dead. Okay. See the box in the center of that rail side? Looks like Maven managed to hide something before. Well, you know. Look around. I am no longer detecting an enemy presence. So there's a cache nearby. Alright. So is it around here? No ammo. It seems like I'm gonna have to use a pistol because I'm uh I'm pretty sure I'm gonna be getting a whole lot of day ammo, so I'm gonna have to use I might have to pick up one of their pistols to be honest. Okay. Piper, somebody help. <laughs> Get away from me, dog. So you guys are just like, just watching these guys, right? Okay. Let me see something. Okay, I bet. Okay, let's keep on going, yeah. This is getting pretty interesting. I don't know what we're gonna find here, but. I just picked up some junk. Hmm. Okay. Nice. Dang, that thing got wrecked already. It's like, bro, it's like I didn't even know what I was shooting at for a second. This is dope, but I can't see what I'm shooting with this, bro. Aim is really good. I do appreciate the fusion shells though. I'll just use y'all. Y'all instituted weapons to kill y'all. Nice, I gotta guess this password. Great, we're locked, now we gotta wait. Hostile sensor reading detected. You don't sense a thing. Come on, bro. Cut me some slack. I will limit the pain I inflict if possible. Can't ever hit him. But they're hitting me. Wow. Oh, I became addicted. That's crazy. Yeah, you guys just keep doing all thing while I try to hack this terminal, bro. Right now it's giving us a hard time. <laughs> Sweet. 
Thank God. Sheesh. Oh my gosh. After numerous tries, y'all. After numerous tries, let's go ahead and do some quick save so we don't have to do that again. Okay, let's kill these synths. Oh my gosh, my aim is immaculate. I need some ammo. This man said whoever, whatever. I should be saying that to you. Okay. Piper, don't be dumb. Let me disarm this. Yeah, it's like new bitch fighting, but sometimes you just gotta rock out. Oh yeah. I just need your then I took out this mess, please. I appreciate all the ammo that you guys are giving me. It is wonderful. Never know what we miss, y'all. So we just gotta look everywhere. Useless. Perfect. All right, let's keep on going, yeah. Hostile sent by order. Be destroyed. Oh no! Oh my God! Quick save. Really quick. We're not taking a chance here. Let's use a stem pack. Yeah, just come and clutch, y'all. I believe that's probably the right way to go. Should be. Ah, oh, nice. Where's that play bud? Carrington, Stanley, Salas, Grodney, Supreme, and Lex. Oh, it says me. Hold on, what's going on here? Okay. What? So, Tommy. You... Dang, Tommy. Whispers to Hold on. His hand cannon, did you pick it up already? Or... I appreciate it. May it serve you as well, heck, better than it did Tommy. Oh, nice. This is dope. Grab I appreciate that. Prototype. You turn that over to Desdemona, and she'll have to let you into our merry band. 
perfecto. No way I was not gonna. Yes. There's an elevator at the end of the hall. It should be a hell of a lot easier fighting the chrome domes on this side of the mine. Okay. We are done. I'm here thinking we took care of the job here. End of the line. Just power up the elevator. Bro, I know you could take care of this terminal for me, dog. It does seem like my camera is about to die soon, so we're about to end the episode real soon, y'all. Um, yeah, let's go ahead and turn those turrets off. I think we learned that last time. So then turrets don't attack us. Because it's probably going to put us on a roof. We got y'all. Okay, come on. Big happy family. Alright, we'll just leave him behind. He'll teleport in. Hmm. The story gets deeper and deeper, y'all. I'm enjoying it. Hold on. <laughs> oh. Ah. Okay, cause I was like, bro, what am I looking at? Wow, that's crazy. Wow. I have no idea, Piper. I'm just looking around, bro. Dope. Is someone present? Nah. Oh. It's funny how they say somebody present. Like, I could have sworn I turned, I turned off those turns. I could have sworn I turned off those turns for this exact reason. Ten. Themselves, yeah. Well, I think the mission here is accomplished. We got what we can. Let's split up and meet back at the catacombs. Dope. Okay, yeah. Let's go ahead and clear the scene. We did what we had to do, y'all. Let me. Hmm. That's where you are, right? There we go. Okay. Okay, okay, I'm enjoying this, y'all. And it's like I said, if y'all want me to play New Vegas, cause I might end up playing that real soon, just to give it a try, cause a lot of y'all have been recommending me to try that game out. You know, I think I will, in all honesty. And I did end up posting a poll on if either I should start The Witcher or Helldivers, and right now it seems like The Witcher is winning, so most likely y'all should get The Witcher soon, you feel me? But I'll see how things are. I might wait on a sale. I don't know. Because right now, when I check, it was 50 I, I thought I'd seen a sale for $15, but I definitely missed that. You feel me? But let's see. Like, this is such a secret tunnel for real, boy. We'll file out separately after you leave. Best not to attract attention here. You made a good team. The best. See you soon. And the new guy patched me up put me on his shoulder, and blasted his way through the rest of the complex. Synths everywhere. Carrying you the whole time? Amazing, right? That's one word for it. Captain <laughs> told me you single-handedly secured Carrington's prototype, disabled a minefield, and wiped out a hundred Gen 1s. So is any of that true? Uh, <laughs> okay. Let's tell the truth here, bro. You know? Mostly true. But there weren't a hundred of them. And Deacon was with me the whole way. Embellishing the truth again, are we? She would have fallen for it, you know? Don't flatter yourself. Still, I was expecting Deacon to grab a full team, including Glory, to secure that prototype. You know, we don't but lie instead, over here, yeah. the two of you cleared out the entire switchboard. You'd be insane not to sign him up. I don't know what Deacon's looking at, but... impression on Deacon. 
He's never spoken about or lied about anyone so highly before. Welcome to the railroad, agent. Nice. I'll join them. I hope it doesn't. Glad to be aboard. It seems we're very lucky. I'll you. join them. I hope it doesn't so mess up anything in. with the miniman. Now we need to know what to call you. Secrecy keeps us alive. Code names are a part of that. So what's yours? Fixer. Professor. Maybe the professor. I like I like the professor giving me money heist vibes, you feel me? Call me Professor. You certainly demonstrated your intelligence. Professor it is. Your first official order is to deliver Dr. Carrington his program. I feel intelligent, yeah. Can use <laughs> but first, it's time to meet the rest of the gang. The location of our HQ is one of our most tightly guarded secrets, so be careful coming in or out. You never can tell when you're being watched. Mm, true. That is dope. This was great. This was amazing. Well, yeah, I thought I was going to finish the episode, but I decided to hop back. I just don't got my um my mic on. I mean my camera on, but let's record for these last few minutes. It may lack the amenities of the switchboard, but it's safe. Take precautions not to be surprised again. Things are chaotic right now, so there's plenty for you to do. Dope. Listen up, everyone. This is the professor. He did the switchboard on. <laughs> I like that. Effective immediately. I'm counting on each of you to show him the ropes. Feel free to welcome him aboard. That is all. It's not an easy road you've chosen, but you're never alone in this. I like that. I like that. I like how they call me the professor. It sounds. It makes me sound special. Agent. Desdemona told me to give you this. An extraordinary feat to recover this, but that's hardly the point. Without a lick of training, and us knowing hardly anything about you, Des has invited you to join HQ. It would have been nice if she had consulted with her second in command. But what's done is done. I think it's because I'm the professor, that's why. So here now, we might as well put you to work. Tell me what you need, Doc. One of our field agents, Old Man Stockton, needs help with the runaway synth. H222. So headquarters, as always, Puts out the fires that others can't be bothered to put out themselves. The paranoid old bat won't even tell us the problem. He insists that we get our intel from a dead drop. Sounds like an important mission. It is. After switchboard, we're so short-handed I have little choice but to throw you into the deep end. The dead drop is a mailbox with a rail sign on it. It's a common means of communication for us, so keep an eye out for them. When you make contact with Stockton, he won't give you the time of day unless you give him the proper counter sign. The current sign is, do you have a Geiger counter? And the counter is, mine is in the shop. Please tell me Deacon taught you that at least. He taught me what I need to know, including that. It appears our resident pathological liar didn't completely neglect your training. Stockton is a prominent businessman at Bunker Hill. The dead drop will be near there. Use the escape tunnel in the back to get there quicker. Hmm. Alright, so it seems like I am about to end the episode here. <laughs> okay, I guess I just went in. I thought, I thought it was going to be a whole introduction. Just talking to everybody. You really want the freedom, Trader. By yourself. Where it is? Diamond City is under opposition control. Nice. I mean, yeah, I would definitely just end the episode here, y'all, to be honest. Because I'm not really going to have time to... I feel like it is going to take longer for me to do what I got to do over here. I do want to drop you guys a long episode one of these days. But it's just when it comes to space-wise, when I'm editing on my map book, it's kind of difficult. And if I really want to do a video like that, I would have to do it without my face. So I could just insert more clips, which takes less space, you know? If y'all see what I'm trying to say. But, um, yeah, we'll just end the video right here. I do appreciate you guys for tuning in, man. I love you guys. And, yeah, without further ado, man, it's your boy Fazo as always. And you already know how this goes. Papa, you gonna do it with me? Let's get it. <laughs> we going, man.